Livingston County, the Board of Commissioners has approved a resolution that requires the Sheriff's Office to track all contact that it has with undocumented immigrants. The move is being slammed by civil rights groups. CBS News Detroit's Meredith Bruckner has been following this story. She has reaction tonight from both sides of the issue. The Livingston County Board of Commissioners on Monday passed a resolution that mandates the monitoring of encounters between sheriff's deputies and undocumented immigrants. The resolution has come under heavy criticism from those who say it fosters division and endangers residents. Oh, I'm very pleased. You know, the vote was 8-0-1. There was one um, commissioner who was absent, so um, I still call it a unanimous vote. It was... Um, uplifting for, from my standpoint. I am a America first person and I really want Americans to be treated with preferential treatment by their elected officials. In response, 19 civil rights groups, faith institutions, local governments and businesses released this statement. Tracking immigration status is not the business of local law enforcement and takes valuable time away from the type of community policing that can actually help keep local communities safe. Immigration law is extremely complicated and local police can easily break the law if they take actions based on speculation regarding an individual's legal status. Livingston County has set a dangerous precedent. In addition to being divisive and impractical, the resolution will also make the county vulnerable to costly litigation at the expense of taxpayers. For his part, Nakagiri says the measure is needed. It's needed so that we policymakers can have some metrics on, you know, what is the extent of the problem and, and maybe we'll find out there is no problem you know we may shift some of the funding around to um, more in the public safety if we need to but i'd like to get as early warning uh, as i can and that early warning comes from the monitoring and the statistics in a recent interview the chair of livingston county democrats judy daubenmeyer told cbs news detroit she believes the move is fear-mongering their strategy of talking about the southern border doesn't work here in the midwest so they have to scare people into thinking they're in danger here when they're not meredith brookner cbs news detroit